A bill designed to make it harder to dump radioactive waste in Kentucky is moving forward. An Estill County representative proposed the bill after the state revealed radioactive waste was dumped at a landfill there. As WKYT's Victor Puente shows us, the bill had no opposition when a House committee considered it this afternoon. This bill isn't meant to introduce new regulations, but it would modify some existing ones. The man behind it says he wants to make sure the state is doing everything it can when it comes to naturally occurring radioactive material. This is the second committee House Bill 563 has been presented to. It would clarify an existing law to make sure solid waste from oil and gas drilling operations that contain low level radioactive wastes are included in prohibited imports into Kentucky. It was introduced by Representative Cluster Howard, who represents Estill County. That's where naturally occurring radioactive material was found in a landfill near two schools. I probably received hundreds of phone calls and emails from constituents there. Howard says he was working with the Kentucky Resources Council to craft the bill. But this caused me to question if we could do more in terms of monitoring and checking these wastes coming from out of state. After a short presentation, it passed out of committee. Senator Embry? Aye. Senator Gerdler? Aye. Unanimously. It will now go on to the full Senate. Earlier this month, the Cabinet for Health and Family Services issued a cease and desist letter to Advance T Norm. That's a waste disposal company located in West Liberty. The Cabinet said they're responsible for bringing that material to Estill County and they could face hundreds of thousands of dollars in fines along with criminal penalties. In Frankfurt, Victor Puente, WKYT. Governor Bevin's office said that he supports the intent of the legislation, but wanted to make a few technical clarifications and review the final bill before he would sign it.